वेलकम टू इट्स टुमारो न्यूज आई एम हेना तलाटी सीवर थंडर स्टॉम्स टू टारगेट टेक्सस टाउन स्ट्रक बाय द डेडली टॉर्नेडो सीवर थंडर स्टॉम्स आर एक्सपेक्टेड टू इंपैक्ट द सेम नॉर्दर्न टेक्सस टाउन स्ट्रक बाय द अनप्रेसिडेंटेड टॉर्नेडो दैट किल्ड फोर एंड इंजर्ड टेन ऑन वेडनेसडे isolated tornadoes and very large hail around 2 inches in diameter are possible friday afternoon and evening across an area from south dakota and wyoming stretching down to the texas panhandle an estimated 7 million people may be affected the storm system is also expected to bring thunderstorms strong winds and hail to the texas and oklahoma pan handles along with the parts of the southwest kansas and along the new mexico border this risk area includes matador texas where homes and businesses were destroyed by the tornado on wednesday to the north the parts of the south dakota wyoming nebraska and northeast colorado may also see severe thunderstorms with very large hail and wind gusts in excess of 75 miles per hour Isolated tornadoes are more likely in this northern risk area than in the southern risk area. On Saturday about 10 million people were at risk of severe storms across the Midwest including the areas of the southern Minnesota, Iowa and Missouri. Very large hail was the main risk followed by the damaging winds and a few possible tornadoes. Des Moines, Iowa and Cedar Rapids, Iowa. could see the tornadoes larger metro areas like kansas city minneapolis and st louis are on the fringe of the severe threat but may experience strong storms by sunday the severe storm threat is expected to shift east to include 14 million people from the southwest ohio down through the northeast arkansas including cities like nashville tennessee cincinnati Columbus, Ohio and Louisville, Kentucky. Heat alerts remained for 19 million people Friday across the southern plains with another day of heat index values as high as 110 to 120 degrees Fahrenheit. The heat index is what temperatures feel like to the human body when relative humidity is combined with the air temperature according to the National Weather Service. Northern and Central Texas had a brief break from the highest heat over the last couple of days but highs will soar back into the upper 90s and the 100s across the region this weekend and into the next week. Temperatures in the Dallas on Sunday may soar to high as 105 degrees Fahrenheit with the heat index of 113. In Houston, residents can expect high of 102 degrees Fahrenheit early next week. More record high temperatures are likely across the Texas and Louisiana next week, especially from Tuesday into the Thursday. All residents have been accounted for after a tornado ravaged a small town in northwest Texas, killing four people and injuring 10 Wednesday night, officials said. That's all for now for more news updates stay tuned with us it's tomorrow news for more global weather updates like this subscribe our channel and hit the bell icon for regular updates <laughs>